They are one of the great treats of fall and winter on Martha's Vineyard. Fresh bay scallops right out of the waters of the vineyard. Only available at this time of year. Bay scallops are smaller, sweeter, and many would say tastier than the bigger, more common sea scallops. They become very popular at island restaurants such as Beach Road and Rockfish. Hi, I'm Guinevere Kramer with Point B Realty. Enjoying bay scallops at a restaurant or fresh at home might by itself make our vineyard bucket list. They're that good. But if you really want the bay scallop experience from start to finish, how about going out and harvesting your own? I've always wanted to try this firsthand. Today, with a little help from my friend and commercial oyster farmer, Greg Martino of Cottage City Oysters, we're heading out into Sendrakataka Pond on the Oak Bluff side to gather by hand. Since it's fall and the water's not all that warm, you need the right gear, waders, warm layers, and of course, a recreational shellfish license. Like all shellfish on the vineyard, scallops are carefully regulated. Greg, thanks so much for joining me and helping make this vineyard experience a reality. Well, thanks for having me. I'm happy to be here. There's a lot of stuff. I thought you just went out and grabbed them. No, you need the basic tools. You have uh, your dip net here okay. to catch the scallops as you see them on the bottom. And to see them on the bottom, you have your peep sight or your viewfinder. You kind of look through that and it allows you to see the bottom floor. Really? Okay. And then you have your bushel here and you can modify it by putting uh, pool noodles around it so it floats so you don't have to carry that around. You can kind of drag it with you. Not only will we be looking for bay scallops, but if we're lucky, Greg tells me we may also find wild oysters and maybe even a clam or two. What we're doing is we are just scanning the bottom with your peep sight. As you look through it, you'll notice that you can see crystal clear oh, yeah. to the bottom. That's the advantage of having this. Otherwise, so it can cool. be murky and you wouldn't be able to see much. Right. You're looking for grass, specifically eelgrass, which is the scallop habitat. And as we comb through, you're just simply looking for the scallop that would be attached or settled into that grass. When you find one, you take your net and you just scoop it up. Okay, all right. Found an oyster. All right, there you go. Yeah, Woo! scoop it up, and then you dump it right in here, right okay, into the bushel. Okay, all right, here, hold my peep, hold my peep sight. There you go. All right, all right, I got this. So a simple trick is just to basically turn the net inside out, and it'll fall right through. After about a half an hour, we have a serious haul. We may not have a full bushel of scallops, but we've got a couple of those, along with some wild oysters, and as I'd hoped, a clam or two. Whether you choose to enjoy bay scallops from the comfort of a restaurant or go for the ultimate ocean to table experience like I did today, enjoying bay scallops during the fall and winter on Martha's Vineyard belongs on everyone's vineyard bucket list. For Point B Realty, I'm Guinevere Kramer.